Exactly. I ain't going nowhere. I'll be Easy. right here. I'll be out here waiting. I'm going to stay right here. I ain't going nowhere. So you can you can leave. Yeah, I'll, I'll leave. You can leave. I'll leave. But, but I'm be, not I'm not going to tell you again. But you'll no, be listen. Sick. No, I got something for but, you. Rio, if you pop up on me again, I'm going to tell Tyler cuz like I I really like it's weird like you're you're I don't know it's being like stalkerish. I I'm, I will tell Tyler I'm here. You that, will tell that, Tyler. That, that's okay, how much now I care. You got that, you. Okay. Look. All right. I'm, I, all I'm saying is You're crazy like I'm saying you keep walking away and stuff Why are you stop you touching keep, me? Oh, don't, don't be yelling don't all that at this park Man what are you doing bro? That is crazy You know you got all these tattoos And you know you, you acting like a tough guy You probably think you're a tough guy And here you are out here simping Putting yourself in a situation That could cost you a lot of issues If she don't want you just leave her alone This is what I'm talking about When men live in this uh, zone Of, of uh, uh, a scarcity You know and not abundance Like she's the only person On the earth that he could get And in his mind that's what he believes And you know that she knows that but you're out there acting crazy. Leave her alone. You sound like you're popping up. You're following her and all of that. Come on, bro. What are you doing? And stop right. following me. You really following me. Come on. See, you got Why people are you looking. Following me? You need to calm all that down. All right. I'm going to keep, like, look. He was just like, I right, just stand there. Look, can I, can I just ask you a question? What? So you don't love me? No. <laughs> you, never, you, never, you never love me. Why never... would I love somebody that don't know how to treat me? The times we had together. The times we had. We I had think, something there. I was immature. I didn't know myself. And, you know, now I understand, you know, I don't need to be with you. At least Tyler treats me better. Like, he he's a gentleman. Even, he can't even provide for you like I was he, providing for you. Okay, bye. He can't do none of that. Bye, Rio. He can't do none of that. But you I can't still believe with he really, though. like, following me. Like, this is crazy. You still with him, and I don't understand that. He ain't providing for and he ain't gonna provide for you. It's because Tyler is probably the bad boy and you're the simp. You're pretending to be the bad boy, but you're a simp. When you said I provide all this stuff and I'm doing that ain't your wife. So what you providing all of this stuff for? You see, she, when she looked at you, she probably thought, oh, he's the bad boy. He's got the tattoos and all that. And then she figured out you, that you were soft. And then when she saw the next bad boy, that's probably a real one. She's attracted to it. That doesn't mean that the bad boy is better than you. It's just that women are attracted to the bad behavior, the bad boys, the men that tell them every single thing. I mean, you don't have to be a complete ass to get a woman, you know, to follow you. You shouldn't actually, you know, do that, have that mindset. But you can't be out there in these streets pretending like you're something else. You expose yourself and now you're stalking the girl. What's wrong with you? She says she gonna tell Tyler. What if Tyler's a maniac? You could lose your life because you trying to fight for some woman that don't even want you. She's let you go. And stop worrying about her future with Tyler. Because a lot of times what happens with people is they don't re realize the grass ain't green on the other side until it's too damn late. They don't realize that they stepped over something that was good for them until it's too late. But sitting there begging and crying and stalking and following around, especially when you know that she's with some guy, is not going to help you. And the odds are what happened is as soon as she broke up with you, he was already there because he was already there to begin with. And that's probably why you butt hurt about it. Because you probably can't believe that she didn't take some time to uh, find somebody else. That's why you heard him say stuff like, you never loved me. Did you really love me? See, these are lessons that men have to learn, but you have to learn the shit and you have to move on, bro. Don't put yourself in situations like this. Don't be begging, stalking, chasing women around. If she found a new man, let her go. Go find more women. Go make more money. Go focus on your own path. What you need to do for yourself, because spending all your time stalking and chasing a woman down that's with somebody else is not beneficial to you. You're just wasting time. You wasting things. You know, you could be doing other things that are way more important. And you're not giving a woman a chance that is actually good for you to show up in your life because you're spending your time trying to chase this one.
Because the reality is this, fellas. We done all went through some shit in relationships. And I will say this from my own personal opinion. If you can be with a woman for a long time, you could be providing for her. You could be doing everything under the sun from her. For her, she might even be a single mom and you done took care of her kids. And all of that. If she could then bounce from you to a next guy after all that investment, after all that time, then she never really cared about you to begin with. Because a woman that really wants to be with you is not going to do that. She's going to try to make it work. She's not going to immediately uh, uh, jump to someone else. She's not going to view men as, oh, another option or a better option. Because you heard her say it. At least he does what you don't do. See? Because women have this false sense of their little list that they go by. Oh, he's not doing it. Oh, he will. And the guy that she's probably with now is probably just telling her every single damn thing she wants to hear because she didn't went and told him, this guy's crazy. He stalks me. He won't leave me alone. I told him I'm in a relationship. Oh, girl, yeah, 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 yeah. I would never do that. He shouldn't be doing that. He's telling her everything she wants to hear. So now she thinks everything is like sunshine and rainbows, but the rain will come. The thunderstorms will clap. You can, you can guarantee yourself that. So if you're a guy, do not do this. It does not help you. And it does not help other men either. And I don't care how many tattoos you get, how much you sag your pants, how much you try to talk tough. If you weak and you a simp, then you weak and you a simp. And it's as simple as that. But guys, let me know what you think about this video in the comments. And please make sure to like the video and do leave a comment because it helps the algorithm push my video out to more people. And I'm trying to get to this 5,000 subscriber mark before the end of the year. And with your help, I can definitely do that. As always, make sure you guys have a good day. And fellas, be safe. I'm out. Peace. May the force be with you.